Hello everyone and welcome to Cece's World. It has been quite a while since the last time I spoke with you. Goodness, I think my last video was hmm, over two weeks ago and I wasn't really showed in it. It was my Georgetown video. Um, so I just wanted to catch up with you guys and let you know what's going on in my world. Um, I know I said that I wanted to start my daily vlogging and once I started trying to do it and piece together um, segments for you every day, I noticed that it was that I wasn't doing enough to justify making um, daily videos in my day. I go to work, I come home, um, yeah, I go to Bible class once a week and I have services on Sunday and then I may or may not go out to eat and I'm thinking that might be a little boring because I don't really do extra stuff. So um, I'm going to wait a little bit on that because I don't want to just be a boring talking face. Um, next thing I wanted to let you guys know something, a new project that I'm working on, is that I am going to, well I am, taking up the Arabic language. This is something that I'm doing so that I can speak to Arabic people, Arabic speaking people um, at my school where I work with where I work at, there's so many different nationalities, a lot of Asian cultures, Indian cultures, and Arabic cultures, and I would love to be able to communicate with them. So I decided that that would be a nice fun project for me to do for the next three years. So I am working on that. Um, the next thing that I am doing is I am working on a book. Um, this book is a little different. Um, then, well, this book is not a novel or something like that. What this book is, is it's, it's kind of like a workbook for people who want to start their life over. As you guys know, I went through in 2011 a real downsizing of my lifestyle. I ended up having to live um, circumstances that I thought I'd never live. And I've gotten back on my feet and I've learned a number of things that one needs if they want to get away from a situation, if they're stuck in a situation where um, that's forced upon them, like mine, where I was unemployed, um, or if they're in a dangerous situation. So this book is all about how to get out, how to plan, um, getting out of a situation, what you need to do, and so I'm hoping that I can have all of that completed by the end of summer and out, and I'll let you know how that process goes. Um, the last thing that I did want to mention to you all is that, um, oh yeah, it's not really mentioning because it's not really something new. It's just something that I have noticed. And I noticed that YouTube videos that I watch, I would love to be able to duplicate those videos. There are so many of those of people, so many different YouTube celebrities that I've seen started exactly where I am, but within a couple of years, they're, you know, near a million subscribers and they have whole teams working with them and I'm not in that situation and I thought about why that is and a lot of their videos and the things that I like about them are things that are beyond my skill set um, beyond my talent even outside of my personal interests so even though I like being entertained by their videos they're not something that I myself um, incorporate in my lifestyle so and then I thought about the people who watch my videos and the and then what's really funny is the people who watch my videos are a lot of um, family women um, women about my age and um, they have a more sedated lifestyle than that singles lifestyle of clubbing and hanging out with a whole group of people and um yeah so having said that I am going to be putting out different type of videos. I'm going to be putting out videos that are things that interest me, um, things that I'm personally kind of good at. And I know I spoke to you guys about my life coaching video, <clears throat> and I haven't focused on that because I've been trying to do like everybody else to get the ratings, to get the subscribers. And I'm finding that's not the way to go. You have to be authentic and true to yourself and work consistently on that. So that is what I plan to be doing in the future and I don't know how regular I'm going to be getting out videos and so forth 
um, while I regroup and start some new projects and you guys will be hearing from me and your emails, the personal messages, because I've got a couple ideas and projects that I would love to work on with you all. That is it for now. I'm on my lunch break. It is a really um, nice weather day. <laughs> Even though it's cloudy, um, the temperature is like 50 degrees, and I decided to come on here on my lunch break and enjoy it. So I thought I'd take you guys along and catch you up. Um, because my hands aren't freezing because I need gloves on because the temperatures are very, very adequate. All right, that is it for now. I gotta stop shaking because I'm wobbling you guys, aren't I? <laughs> um, that is it for now. I hope you guys have been having a wonderful winter, a wonderful um, beginning of your new year, staying focused with all your goals that you've set. And until next time, keep smiling.